So here we are at the final of the Europa League for the players' eyes firmly fixed on lifting that trophy. Led by the officials and the respective captains, here come the stars. Chelsea have chosen to go 4-3-3. Jim, how do you see it? Yeah, and the two wide players up front can make the system pretty much succeed or fail. They'll be quite flexible in their creative movement. They like to drift in. At times, they'll mix their game up and, and keep their width. And, of course, they're also expected to track any runs from opposition fullbacks. So they've got quite hard-working jobs. But if they can gain a one-on-one -on -one advantage, they can dictate. So, just who will seize their moment? As with a lot of finals, caution plays a big part in the opening stages, but an early goal can blow all that away, so I hope that we can um, create a, a, an attacking contest here, which, which obviously we want for this showpiece. Tries a through ball, and he's made certain that won't get through. Going through. Obama Yang. it's Lacazette! Goal! Listen, the big names earn their reputations for precisely the reason we've just seen. They have a habit of making their presence felt, and here we are, early stages. He struck one, and he looks hungry for more. Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Big occasion, big goal, crucial lead. Well, Peter, the emphasis should now switch to winning it rather than even thinking about losing it. Marcos Alonso eyeing that space. Granit Xhaka. It's come loose. Messi tries to get it forward quickly. Lacazette floats one over. has got good distance on that. Has a hit! Good stop, that wasn't easy. Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper, has just received an A-plus grade. Cristiano Ronaldo. Conte. 
Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. This arm crosses it in low. Messi. The shot's on! Kovacic. Rudiger. Arsenal scored early, of course, and it's 1-0. Some good play on the left-hand side now to profit from it. He's got away. Lovely bit of skill there. El Neni. Messi. Hector Bellerin. Azar. Now the pass. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Messi. Well, that's a foul, no two ways about it. He has resisted the temptation to go to his pocket, it's just a stern lecture. Brushed off the ball there. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Well, that's clearly not what he wanted to do. Aimed long and direct. Christensen. Raspilicueta. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Drink water. William. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Can he score? Cristiano Ronaldo! Just a fraction high. Cristiano Ronaldo almost put a side ahead with a, a pretty fierce attempt. He really spanked that. to Bayerin. Now it's Azar. Koscielny does well to read it and intercepts. Kovacic plays it forward. It's Cristiano Ronaldo! Cristiano Ronaldo really got caught in a trap. Drink water. He's the guilty party there. Kolasinac, Arsenal are ahead here, it has been a good half for them. And the shot! Really well taken goal. And there's the goal they've been looking for. And time and space are plenty, he was never going to miss. Well, he made it obvious as to where the pass should be played, Peter, and it made the finish look that bit easier. Arsenal grab a couple of goals without reply, it's 2-0. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other. Ball is over the line. And he's 
just there to cut it out. Forward it goes. Now it's Lacazette. And it's Hector Bellerin. Hazard. Kovacic passes it through. Kolasinac. And it's Aspilicueta. And now the finish! Cristiano Ronaldo! Oh, and with that, the half-time whistle goes. So, we've had the first 45 minutes of the final, Jim. How's it looking for you? Well, it's obvious who's likely to be more content going in at half-time, but I sincerely hope that there's a, a fitting response from the opposition to really engage us on the big occasion. Arsenal in control at half-time. 2-0. Just back from your break, you've missed very little of the resumption of the second half. As Pericueta cuts it out, Kovacic. Cristiano Ronaldo. Kovacic. Jorginho plays it out to the wing. Now it's Hazard. It's Asa! Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeping. Listen, the manager seems to have impacted during the break. This is now a show of real purpose. Messi, this is promising. Christensen goes looking. Marcos Alonso goes up and over. Oh, good interception. A slightly better ball would have led to a very different outcome there. Ah, quality deserted them when they really needed it. Well, he's not played the ball, that's a foul. And it's Messi. Gets wrestled off the ball. Messi, good run, where to for Messi? And he's there to make a great save. The keeper really dug out his defence then, a magnificent effort. A spectacular effort! A great save, real class. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Lacazette. Hector Bellerin. This defence is, is wary about opposition pace. So they're just not getting too tight? Yeah, they know that if they, they step up, their, their keeper could get a whole lot busier. Can't get the better of his opposite number. Granit Xhaka, looking up to see who wants it. And it's Lacazette. Now it's Aubameyang. Raspilicueta plays it forward. Socrates as well there, alert. Kolasinac. Oh, that's a foul. Simple decision for the referee. Been lenient here. I doubt he'll get too many more chances. For Pastathopoulos. Good challenge. He just stood firm. Looks to slip it through. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge.
Jorginho. And it's Lacazette. Jorginho with the slide tackle there. Aimed long and direct. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. That always looked inevitable. The defence dealt with that really well. And it's Kolasinic. And Messi! He's done very well to get to that. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. It so nearly came off for him. Well, Peter, I think it's fairly obvious he's one of the biggest influences out there. Hazard. Looks like a good ball through. That intervention was very necessary. He's gone for it! Dispatched clinically. Right back in the game. Are certainly a team that knows how to play their football as stylishly as you'll see. Tiki Taka at its very best and they back it up with goals. change that was in the offing last one allowed well for me this was the obvious substitution he'd become just a little jaded and as a result of that he was most likely to make a mistake I think sometimes when the body becomes tired the brain goes with it and I think that's happened in this case this is threatening to become a really good game well they've given themselves a chance here but now it's a case of getting the balance right between attack and defense and that's not easy Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Who's ball? Who's going to get that? Foul and a free kick in a very dangerous area. And the referee has shown him a yellow card. Well, I think the alternative was to stand there and, and do nothing while he, he tried to score. And obviously, he's not going to allow that, Peter, is he? Well, he has great set-piece prowess. I think you know what's coming, but stopping it... Another matter. Messi. Ready to try one. Messi! Oh, that is special! A finish right from the top draw. Unbelievable. And surely now, the results beyond doubt. And he's produced a beauty. Arsenal take a two-goal lead and are looking good for the win. Kante tries to get it forward quickly. Moses. Looks to slip it through. Almost nothing left on the clock here. Just a few moments from glory. Leno deals with it effortlessly. Kolasinac. Forward it goes. And it's Aubameyang. Aubameyang into opposition territory. Aubameyang! There was plenty of power on that. And that's exactly the type of adventure we want to see in a final two, Peter, and it's a pity it didn't cause the net to bulge. Xhaka passes it through. He's left his man. Moses. And the referee brings it to a close. Simply, the big day was their day. A day for them and their fans. A truly proud line in their history. So on to centre stage come the central characters. The individuals who, as a team, blended into champions.
and this is their moment.